What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Blue Fox 22 coming back at you with more Minecraft episode 9. We are one episode away from episode 10. I always get excited when I get to the 10th episode of any kind of series because it means we're making progress. We're getting farther. Uh, in between episodes. I don't know if I caught this on on re recording or not, but um, yeah, I got attacked by some illagers. That was my first raid. So, I cleaned up the um, uh, smeltery. So now, we have 32 buckets because it only counts the, uh, the tanks that are actually attached to the smeltery that make up the actual smeltery itself. But I do have them pumping lava into the system. So, uh, everything is, should be set up and we should be good to go. Uh, I can test this real quick. If I brought my buckets, which I did not. So how's everybody doing today? I'll explain all this, this stuff when we get back. Cause, uh, today, um, we have some stuff to get because I actually want to tackle the, uh, I did accidentally get the finish this. I should have waited. <clears throat> but uh, you can start create by clicking this and it will actually give you the wrench to start create. But <clears throat> I wanted to get some of this stuff done in the quest book and most of the stuff in the tips and tricks uh, section are pretty easy to make. So we're going to do that today. We've already made two well i found uh the diamond site and i i had the emerald site i don't know what what happened to the diamond site i don't even know where it went but the emerald site i used it on film when i was mining and it didn't i didn't do anything because i guess there just wasn't any emeralds in the area where i was at um oh yeah out here oh fuck it help if I get a bucket but uh we'll be starting refined storage soon I think that's gonna be episode 10 so if I take a bucket of lob out of you are you gonna fill back up yes you do and you should be good yeah all right we're good Alright, I'll just throw these buckets of lava in the inventory because, I, yeah, that's just hilarious. You just store lava in one of these. <coughs> Come back to it later and it's a bucket of stone. No, it's a bucket of obsidian. <laughs> uh, in between episodes, I wanted to start Batania. So I have my man of steel scissors uh, with an enchantment. So uh, we're, I'm slowly running out of enchantment books. Um, pretty much two man of steel. We have man of steel, so why not? But, uh, I'm going to hold off on doing that. So in between episodes, I'm going to be working on some minor stuff behind the scenes. That way, when we do do the episodes, we're not taking an hour just to explain stuff. But, uh, yeah, this is my secondary storage, uh, bin. I had this, but today we're going to use this stuff. <clears throat> Some of this stuff. Uh, that, 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 that. And then I will be working on this structure for this in between episodes. Because I want to start using mob ground utilities. Because I noticed the other day, while in between episodes... And in the nether, wither skeletons don't spawn, and I don't know why. With the current resources that I have, I can only make one wither skull. And lo and behold, wither skulls have no EMC. So I would either have to cheat and give it an EMC value, which I don't want to do because... 
Uh, what? Uh, maybe help one. Help. <laughs> Incorrect argument for command at position five. Help. Okay, help is disabled then. Okay, never mind then. I couldn't use it even if I wanted to. I think if I type in... Uh, uh, let's try... Yeah, Project E. Project E set EMC. And then I could set an EMC value, which I don't want to do. <clears throat> I will if I have to, but I don't want to do that just for one item. Um, if we can relatively get it. Even if I can just find the withered ribs, then finding a wither skeleton isn't going to be the end of the world. But it's converting skulls and the wither skulls so i would have to find a way to convert zombie heads into skulls i know i can turn that into a creeper head and creeper head it creeper head to a wither skeleton skull using blood but we need promise tenacity Machine tier upgrade, also usable for lower tier recipes. 10 capacity times eight. Oh, okay. So that increases 10 capacity, but we just need the blood. How would I make that? Diamond promise acceptor. Bowl of promises. <laughs> Not used up in crafting. A bowl of promises. E e evil craft sounds fun. <laughs> we're still doing this around uh october i think the minecraft videos will revolve around like evil craft and stuff like that and then i'll see if abyssal craft is available if that's available oh. as uh i can't think of his name ah as racist as hp lovecraft is oh his works the ones that he actually worked on are amazing and for everything else that have you know people have created after with just the foundation that he laid as far as you know creatures and characters are concerned horror masterpiece in my opinion because if you've ever seen the movie it yeah that that it and like the precursor to the adult form of the xenomorphs, the face hugger. Oh, HP Lovecraft vibes. Just long, spindly, tentacly, you know, just gross. <clears throat> like, it, just looking at it makes you uncomfortable. Because you're trying to figure out what, what am I looking at? All right, first things first, we need the book for Aldemodium. Easy, two books. Quest completed, all the monium. This pretty much gives you a rundown of all the monium and any other, like, any other related materials. So you have all the monium, vibranium, and un unobtainium. All the monium gives you, oh, okay. Um, uh, you can also find it in, in it as a common spawn very high in the mountains above 700 and 100 and 700, <clears throat> 170 Y it can also be found everywhere in the mining dimension between negative 59 and Y 20, but it is very rare. It is a very rare spawn there. Vibranium found in the crimson and warped forced biomes around 1.7 to 1.13. 
is also found in the other dimension. The other. In the ancient crimson forest and ancient warped forest biomes. Usually very close to piglin villages. Unobtainium. Unobtainium can be found in the end. The end highland biome. It spawns under Y78. Y78? That's very specific. <laughs> uh, all right. I'm going to go through. Ooh. Teleport pad. Teleport pad is used to teleport to the mining dimension and the other. You need to shift right click with both an, with both an empty hand and off hand. As a note, the mining dimension is disabled in the all the mod six to the sky pack. Okay. <clears throat> um, mining dimension. Okay, so it just tells you mining dimension is useful to set up quarries to mine in. It is also very useful to use as a testing area since it is a super flat dimension to teleport to the dimension. Use the teleport pad in the overworld. The other. The other is a very hostile dimension. <clears throat> dimension to teleport to the, to the dimension. Use the teleport pad in the nether. Little is known of this place, but it seems to be where picklins come from. Huge underground cities exist in the ancient crimson and the ancient warped forests, as well as dungeons and ancient pyramids full of monsters and loot. Oh. <clears throat> oh, I think we do we need to have interdimensional power and do we need to go and explore other places? I think we have our next two episodes, episode 10, episode nine. We're going to go in the mining dimension and see what we can do and deal with some interdimensional power transfer and all that. I have to look into the Tesseract mod. Hmm. And then episode 10, I think we should go to the other. Yeah. This has been very, very fruitful looking through this book. Armor. All the Bonium armor. Pretty self-explanatory. But... <clears throat> all the Bonium armor has several benefits other than just the armor. Toughness and knockback resistance. Water breathing. No crash damage when landing with elytras immune to fire damage no fall damage when you upgrade the armor with netherite it keeps the enchants that is awesome <laughs> all right all right let's get out of this next up <clears throat> in our list we did that it's all direwolf 20s gadgets so that includes the destruction gadget, the copy paste gadget, the building gadget, and the exchange gadget. I'm surprised I don't have. Yeah, I do have it. Mining gadget. Uh, mining gadget. I mean, if we're going to do it, we might as well do it. Do all of it. Uh, modification table. And we'll get the. Mark one, mark two. Might as well go for the Mark three. It looks cool. Look at the Mark three. Like I said, I mean, if we're gonna go for it, might as well go for it. Um, I'm gonna get the blank a uh, great module because we're gonna need it anyway. Deconstruct the blocks right to your inventory. Ah, uh, no. A uh, great three by three. Light placer, yeah, we need both of these. So we'll do upgrade three by three, light placer. Fortune one, Ooh, that's a lot of lapis. I think we have enough lapis, we can do this. Yeah. Freezing, freezes water, soft lava in its place. Oh, we could definitely use this. But I think I'm definitely gonna I'm gonna need snowballs like I thought. And I have no way of getting snowballs right now. Uh blast chiller. But oh, well, ball cast. Wouldn't that work with the, the cast from Tinkers? 
uh, servo and yeah, and Blizz Cube. All right. So we'll hold off on freeze for now. Um, but we're gonna need that, and we're gonna need the range upgrades and the battery, and we'll get tier two efficiency. All right, so we're going to be busy for the next few minutes. Uh, I want to clean up my inventory real quick. I can go in there. Can go away. You can go away for now. You can. Oh, I can't put you in the backpack yet. Soon. You are like one of my goals is, is to put this backpack in this backpack. <laughs> okay, Thunder. Calm down. All right, uh, we need these, so you'll see why. All right, so let's get started. Uh, first up, we need our basic generator. And in order to make the basic generator, we need an LV battery. LV battery is LV cable, some redstone and some tin. LV cable, we're gonna make some. So we need rubber. I had rubber sapling. But that rubber tree sapling did not work out. So, number one, we have this for mob grinding utilities. I've been topping off every now and then and uh, filling that up. As you could tell, I have the experience to spare. So, the rubber tree sapling does not work with bonsai pot. I don't know why. It just doesn't. So to alleviate that, I had to figure out what I could use to make rubber. And then I remembered what I used for the last video because we needed some slime. Earth slime grass, easy to make. I already had green heart slime saplings. This is like the best thing ever. And then compacting drawer. Diamond upgrade. It's not expensive, had the diamonds, void upgrade, easy peasy. And this makes infinite, just infinite, just keeps making infinite slime. And then I just come down here and I take as much as I need. <laughs> Since it's locked, I don't have to worry about losing it. Just throw these in here like this. Okay. Um... As far as backpacks are concerned, I upgraded my stacking upgrade, which was a pain in the ass to do because I kept forgetting that I had the iron pipes in here and it kept yelling at me when I tried to take it out. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're good as far as that's going. Why is this still open? I always have that open and I don't know why. Anything working gooey as well. Okay. So we're good with that. I can actually turn the magnet. Now nah, to keep this magnet off. All right. Um, as far as backpackers are concerned, this backpack, for some reason, would not let me upgrade it. Took me forever to figure out how to get it to upgrade. I don't know what was going on. And then I realized that that mod has two separate sets of upgrades. One's for the barrels, and one's for the backpacks. That's where I messed up at. But, mm. All right. So, we have slime now, and you can just cook slime. To make rubber. I don't know what I could use this for. Sliming? Oh, sliminess for productive bees. Okay, we're going to get into productive bees, don't worry, because that is actually pretty cool. <laughs> um, there was a Minecraft series for the Yogscast with Duncan, Boba, and either Penguin. Yeah, Duncan, Boba, Penguin, and Rav, Ravs, and I was watching that, and they were using uh, resource bees. And uh, it's actually... Pretty f looked pretty good. So or productive bees, not resource bees. It looked actually pretty fun. So I was like, "Yep, yep." If I get when I get back into my or back into Minecraft, whether it's you know just for me or for, uh, oh, I can put this in the foundry. I can get two blocks and one slime ball. Wait, 
For one slime block, I get two blocks and one slime ball? What? That don't seem right. <laughs> okay. One become two. Anyway, those are cooking up, turning into sh turning in turning turning into rubber. And we get sixty four of them now. So we just throw that in there. And like I said, this we need to make LV battery. We need to make LV cables. So I uh, just make a whole bunch and just do that. Uh, then now that we got that, we can make our battery. And I'm going to make several of these. And you can actually charge these. I don't know if it'll work in this or not. Let's find out. No, won't work in that. I'm surprised my... All items, it's not charging it. I guess they're not compatible. But I'm glad I checked this because you need charged. Not even sh 2 million RF? What is going on? What? 200,000. 200,000. 100,000. 2 million? Since when did you hold 2 million? I thought it was 200,000. I mean, now we're eating into it because the these poor guys down here can't keep... Oh, no! Expletive, expletive, expletive. Mm. I'll be back. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I'm back. I cleaned up the mess that I made by accident. I kind of compacted everything down. So now each machine technically has their own power source of power. Um, it's separated. So except for these two, I could just bring this down and over, but I feel like doing all that. Um, so let's finish up what we were doing and we'll make our basic generator. Oh, we need an iron for an empty, sir. Let's make a couple. <laughs> I'm going to get two of these, because I want to make a geothermal generator. Again, with the glass. Alright. You know, like my generator. That's an iron furnace. What you do with my generator? What you do with my generator? Generator. Huh. So, a uh, story to tell you. Uh, back when I was in, uh, still in Triangle Tech, one of my classmates, when he finally decided to wake up, decided to ask me and another one of our classmates, uh, hey, guys, do you, because I was in a CAD, a CAD program, which is uh, computer-aided drafting. And uh, we were working on a project, and he goes, Hey guys, do you, do you know the measurements for the generator? And me and my other classmate who's sitting next to me, we look at each other. And we both turn around and look at him. And my classmate goes, What did you say? And he repeats. Because I'm pretty sure my classmate was thinking the same thing. Let me give him another chance to realize what he said. <laughs> So, I go, yeah, what? He goes, the measurements for the generator. My classmate goes, do you mean the generator? And I just look and I'm holding in from just dying from laughter. <clears throat> and he goes, oh, yeah, yeah, that's it. What do you mean? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's it. No, <laughs> just, just no. 
Oh, uh, but yeah, that 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 day, that just cracked me up. I'm like, you guys have the measurements for the generator? The generator? Sure. <laughs> generator. And then any time I mention a generator to Mandy, she starts cracking up and goes, "Don't you mean generator?" And I'm like, "Ha, ah, ha, ha." ha. Ha 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 ha! Ha ha! Yay! We have magma power. Yeah, and I can charge my batteries now. Man, I can charge my batteries now. I won't. I won't fall over anymore. <laughs> Powering down. I love that. As soon as it's at max power, it just stops. It just shuts off. It doesn't waste lava. That's what I want. So we have an infinite lava source. We have infinite Kerbalstone being made. Oh. And now with the geothermal generator, we technically have uh, infinite power, but it's not that great of a generator. So we'll think about more generational stuff later on down the road, but that takes care of those two. What time are we at? 26? Oh, we have time. Plenty of time. What is that? No oh. I'm like, why do I hear? I forgot I put that there. That scared me. Andy, hmm? I forgot I put this here. <clears throat> it scared me. All I, I'm just like, oh, I'm gonna come up here and sleep through this storm. Oh God, there's a dis there's a, there's a severed head. How did anybody get access to my world? It's not open to the internet. What's going on, man? Anyway, hmm. we'll sleep through the storm. So, oh yeah, I got a smithing table. Wow. I got a smithing table while I was also out, and I also found a fletching table and a lectern. Alright, so we got the geothermal generator. I'm going to put the basic generator away. We don't need that right now. I mean, uh, it, all the power we can get helps, but... <sighs> it's fine. Alright, so next, I actually want to make the worm bin... Uh, the worm bin will be for the uh, uh, water strainer mod. Uh, give me one second. All right. Um, so we got that. Let us. I need the experience solidifier. Oops. <laughs> All right. Let's work on something else. So, we're going to make a market. Easy peasy. Uh, we need red wool. I don't have any red dye. That is the weirdest thing that I should have, and I don't. Could have swore I gathered up a whole bunch of flap. They're just on fire. Hey, Jim. Hey, Bob. How are you feeling today? I'm good. You're on fire. So are you. I think I'm about to die. Yeah, me too. <laughs> oh, man. I didn't get out of the sun in time. Oh, well. Uh, sorry for the stutter in the leg. Stutter in the leg. Okay, I got some yellow flowers just in case. No, go in the... Don't go in there. Alright, now let's try this again. Wood. Do, do, do. Do. 
Yeah. I don't have enough. Well, why are you using dark oak logs? Just use oak logs. I have plenty. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I can get a whole bunch. All right, sweet. Got the market. Now, the nice thing about the market is if you have the uh, if you have the right items, I'm gonna put them downstairs. Eh. They can creepishly be up in my room. Oh wait, frigate! I forgot. They need a space. Otherwise, they will die. <laughs> Hello, you are my people, and you need me. So, one emerald gets you whatever seed you need, whatever sapling you need, and bone meal. So, yeah. Doubt I'll ever need this, but... It 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 it, 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 it calms my soul knowing I have a guardian who will protect me in case some kind of monster attacks me in the middle of the night. And if you believe that you're crazy. Anyway, uh next up Where is that? Okay, there we go. What uh thirty one. Alright. We'll clear that. We'll clear you. Uh eccentric tome. Need to make a library. I need specifically fur planks. Or dictionary be like frustrating sometimes. Just need that and that. And what? Or dictionary be frustrating sometimes. Where'd that library block go? Library, where you go? L library. That's a crafting table. Library, there we go. Eccentric tome. Is this what I think it is? Oh, if I can do this. And I could put all these books in that tome. So do I do that? No. What 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 just happened? Uh oh. Uh oh. I think we're... Did we crash? No. Oh, okay. I was like, what just happened? Okay. Well, I can't interact with anything. Eccentric tome. Do I need to do this? No. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, because I can't interact with the world anymore. And there's nothing there for me to do. So I'll look into that and figure out what's going on. <laughs> because if I, that's why I wish I had a Kaushik Tome. Because if I had that, I wouldn't have all these books in my... I wouldn't need a... Pretty much wouldn't need a backpack anymore. Because it's pretty much why I have a backpack. All right. We need, oh, Neil, in the tool by tool, we need three by three. I'm about to say, I can make a tool belt. That's easy. I can make a hammock. Just need some wool. Just make a hole. Where's my string? So I know how much I have. Stringy, stringy, string. Where are you? There we go. Oh, I can make a whole bunch. There we go. I think I killed my string, but I'm not worried about it. All right, uh, hammock. 
Oh, I need strength. Uh, what? Uh, string, flax string, sinew fiber. Uh, string from chelicerae. So I think I have a whole bunch of chelicerae. And the flax plant itself. But I think I have a whole bunch of chelicerae from killing spiders. <clears throat> yeah, I got 14 of them. Okay. We're good. <laughs> Except for sticks. It, it Or dictionary. Come on. Uh, you just do me wrong sometimes. Just do me wrong sometimes. All right. And that, no. no. Stop making those. That's not a sleeping bag. <laughs> That's not a sleeping bag. Okay, there we go. I was like, wait, what is this? This seems important. I was like... That's not a sleeping bag. <laughs> uh, that That's a wool slab that is actually useless to me. Okay, we need other things for that. Uh, personal shrinking device. And everything but the bitten. Everything but the bitten. I make a couple of bitten's. There we go. We got a couple of bitten's. All right. Uh, I'm not even going to say it. Not even going to say it. Not even going to say it. Uses in-game documentation and to enter compact machines. And then we need scratched glass pane. Yeah, I was like, can I just get a regular scratch glass pane? I'll do it myself. Wait, what? <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> I don't know. We'll be here all day. Ah, six. Shows how much vanilla I play. <laughs> okay. No, that's connected glass pane. Maybe I could do it just regular glass pane. Let's try that. Yeah, it's just a glass pane. Doesn't have to be specifically scratch glass pane. I say that's very specific. Drinking dice. All right. And then we need compact machines, which we need to make compact machine wall and just blank, just planks. Compact machine wall. Iron and redstone, and it gives you 16 of them. I just used them all of my iron. Alright. Oh, or dictionary worked for me this time? No, what's going on here? Three by three by three. Uh, compact machine I have never used, so that'll be new for us. I'll be new for the channel. Um, compact machines are the core mechanic of this mod. They allow you to build large rooms in a single block space connected to the out, outside world. They come in various sizes, ranging from three by three by three to 13 by 13 by 13. You can use tunnels to connect the outside block fences with any of the inside walls to transport items, fluids, etc. 
You can enter a compact machine by right-clicking it with a personal shrinking device. Please use JEI to look up crafting recipes. Okay. So that's used to actually interact with that. So I guess we'll build one of those one day. I, uh, are you empty? No, you're not installed. Where are you? What? What? Where is my capacitor? <clears throat> what happened to my flux capacitor? It disappeared. What? Oh, is it still on the table? <laughs> <laughs> I left it in the table. Oops. So I was like, why isn't my stuff charging? Why did it take me this long to notice? That's bad. How are you doing? All right, that's not bad. I think this is the one that makes me go, uh... What? What was... Uh... Is this the one that shrinks you or shrinks other things? Let's go find out real quick. Uh, oh, it shrinks them. <laughs> uh, they're tiny skeletons. All right, I'm getting out of here. I'm lagging out bad. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh, oh no. All right, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. That's funny. Okay, we're gonna have fun with that. Just shrink them down and then whack them. Uh, we'll put that down. Uh, we'll put that down in the next episode. So the way these work, uh, this is a sleeping bag. Just plop it down wherever you can. not I have arrows stuck in me still. Plop it down, sleep through the night, and uh, you can just keep on going. And I don't think it resets your spawn point. So if you have a base and your spawn point is both back at base, when uh, you die while you're out out and about using that to sleep through the night, um, it'll still come back to your spawn point. So that's a good thing. Enderman. I see you, Enderman. Where did you go? Where are you? There, get back here, Enderman. Maybe that's why I'm missing a block in the, my wall. There we go. No. I see you. Are you mad now? You don't lost your mind. Ow. What's wrong? Can't move? It's okay. Bone shield. All right. So, uh, when we come back in the next episode, we will work on our mining gadgets and we'll get all the, you know, dire wolves uh, building gadgets. And then we'll work on... Uh... I think we'll work on going to those other dimensions um, or create. Because that seems really, really interesting. Oh, so, yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for tuning in. As always, I'm your host, Michael Gardner, a.k.a. Blue Fox 22. As always, stay safe, stay as healthy as humanly possible, and above all, stay foxy. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, ladies and gentlemen. 
I'll see you in the next episode. Take care. It was a wonderful day and or night. And bye-bye.